Hello, this is Mrs. Bobby, and today we are looking at lesson six of module three. We're going to be looking at opposites um, and rational numbers. Rational numbers are just numbers that can be written as a fraction, so they could actually be a typical fraction, a whole number, because all whole numbers go over one. They could be a mixed number, like three and five tenths, or they could be like a decimal. Um, like three decimal point four, which could be written as three and four tenths, or it could just simply be like a negative, um, a negative number, a negative fraction or something. So these are all versions of rational numbers. So it's very simple. We see a number, we do its opposite. So if we see 10 sevenths, that's a positive 10 sevenths. So its opposite is negative 10 over seven. And if we see a negative five thirds, we're going to look at is a positive five thirds. And we have three and 82 hundredths. So that would be negative three and 82 hundredths um, as a decimal. And then we see negative uh, one half, negative six and one half. So that would be positive six and a half. So that is as easy as it gets right there. Um, now, the next thing is if we're looking at this number line on number two, it says choose a non-integer. So a non-integer means it's not one of the whole numbers. It's not a negative one, a zero, or a one. It's something between something. So we have between zero and one. So let's say a fourth. Let's do a fourth. So we would have zero, one fourth, two fourths, three fourths, four fourths which is your whole one. And then we would have negative one fourth, negative two fourths, which is a half, negative three fourths, negative four fourths. So we can label one fourth, two fourths, three fourths, so on and so forth. And it says, label it point A. So if we pick the number, we'll pick this, let's say this, we're gonna label that A. And then we look at its opposite, and its opposite of a positive fourth is a negative one fourth. So that would we call it B, right? Values below the points. So we did all this, and that's how we find opposites. Opposite of a positive three fourths is a negative three fourths. Opposite of a negative one is the positive one. So that is our lesson today. Hope everybody understood that. If not, you can rewind. Have a great afternoon.